there. It came off the stick of Zach Lambos, and I believe it might have been Carter King who was in front of that. There was a pioneer there, now a two-on-one chance the other way. Score! Jaron Wright, what a big lead for Denver! We've talked a lot about transition, and again, Denver looking to push the pace up ice, and they're able to do so to create an odd man chance, and Wright takes a look over at Sam Harris, but he elects to shoot as the back checker was coming into play, and Harris was there whacking at it. I thought Galambos tied him up, but it looked like Harris's stick got caught underneath row, and he couldn't get it loose to try and get that rebound. Denver with one more chance, they score! It was right after the power play had expired. Cedric Fiedler burst out of the box for the Pioneers cash in anyway, it's two to nothing. I believe it will be Alex Weirmeyer and if that is the case, it is his first collegiate goal. The pass comes in from the side from Lemaire, and Weiermeyer's right in front, able to get a stick on it. Neutral zone. Lundberger lost his footing and a chance for Western Michigan. And the first goal of the night for the Broncos on a shot that trickled off of Matt Davis. It's a two to one game. Western Michigan taking advantage of the opportunity. You see Buckberger, he loses his footing at the Pioneer blue line. It's almost like something, it might be his, sometimes players wear a guard when they go to, to help protect on the road. We asked him about, you know, at this stage in the season, how much are you kind of tweaking, changing, installing new stuff? He said, you know, we really don't change a lot ever. We really just try to stick to our principles. A side million. Speaking of principles, the junior comes through with that wrister from the blue line. And Booyum has given Denver some breathing room in a three to one lead. That lethal Shai Booyum shot comes to play with 18.52 to go in the third. Well, what a huge turn of events. Denver killing penalties at the end of the second. Carries over, they get it killed. One goal lead, anybody's game, still certainly anybody's game. But for Shai Booyam to get that goal, put Denver up to a huge, huge ball. Leaves it for Granger, the captain. If that goal would have stood, it would have been for Dylan Wentz. And earlier this week, Pat Firstweiler told us Granger and Wentz are two great examples of what this program is built on. Those guys have been great tonight. And right on cue, it is Dylan Wendt who comes through on the feed. And with the extra man, Western Michigan has narrowed it to one with 2.10 to go. Dylan Wendt, he thought he had a goal a moment ago. They stick with it, and he gets this goal. Wendt's going to get the goal, but this is all Alex Kemp as he wraps around the top and then he's able to just slide the backhand over to Dylan Wendt. Great.